So this is a Sage 4 computer with a uh, C Ito uh, 500 terminal. This is a portrait style uh, terminal. Um, I recently got this set up and running. Didn't need too much. Um, these uh, Sage computers were notoriously uh, in a good way. They were well. They were known for for their longevity. Um, I just wanted to show it running because I don't know that there are any videos of Sage computers on YouTube. So I thought I'd post this and let people enjoy it a little bit. We're gonna go ahead and power it on. You reach around the back, there's a little power switch. Uh, if I can find it, sorry. There we go. It says Sage startup test. All right, and you get the monitor prompt. And um, then you type in IH for initialized hard drive. It boots from the hard drive. It's a 40 megabyte hard drive, which was huge for 1983. And this is a P system. So this is a program sy programming system for um, development in Pascal and uh, other languages. We're gonna uh, update the time. And there you are, there's our menu uh, for the P system. That's really it. There's, I'm not a programmer, I don't know Pascal, so I can't really do very much with it. Uh, I assume that there will be some visitors to this museum space who, um, who do and would like to mess around with a little bit, show me what it's capable of. You can also put in the floppy I have a, where did it go? Where did my floppy go? Hold on. I have a floppy of... Did I put it under this stuff? Gosh, was it in here? Oh, it's already in the drive. Duh. Okay. So, if we do that and then we reset the machine, Reset that yep. And then initialize floppy, I can boot from floppy. So I F and this is CPM eighty six or sixty eight, sorry, CPM sixty eight K. Uh, and uh Because some options we're not going to initialize C, no. I'm not sure that there's actually a, um, I'm not sure there's actually a CPM partition on that drive, and I'm a little afraid to delete something. And then we can look at what's on the directory of A. Yeah, and there's our various utilities, BIOS, etc., for the Sage computer. Uh, and that's, that's basically it, I believe. We've got pips, we can transfer files off of this if we needed to. We might do that for archival purposes later. But that's the Sage 4 computer.